Good evening everyone, this is Jack here and uh, welcome to my channel again and uh, today we're talking about the alliance wars in the empires and puzzles and um, there has been a lot of uh, tutorials and um, you know about the um, the alliance wars so I won't uh, talk about you know how to do the setup and uh, why you know do we have the same color of tank blah 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 you know those kind of things and uh, you can see a lot of uh, useful videos and uh, by a lot of uh, a lot of players so which is uh, very very useful and I thank them very much and um, you know uh, to help me to go to this point but uh, what I want to say is uh, there are some uh, something that uh, you might be interested in in knowing that so first of all and um, see if you realize if you calculate you know add up all the uh, all the available points for each team and so the total points would be for one round is 1500 points so the reason uh, that I know that is uh, once I just uh, put myself one of my accounts and uh, in one alliance and uh, basically you know so 1500 points is uh, the available points each round so that's um, that I know and uh, second and uh, so which means uh, you know for all six rounds so if you know everyone is uh, hitting the opponent in one shot the maximum available points would be 9000 points so 9000 points is the uh, the full mark basically so if you've got 6000 points at the end of the war so basically your win rate is about 66 percent so this is uh, like the percentage and um, you know if you want to have uh, some improvement or something and you can uh, use this calculation out of 9000 points and uh, how much points actually you've got and uh, second and uh, a lot of um, people are saying you know the uh, why some teams are actually very weak but they have a lot of available points but uh, whereas uh, some people and um, it's uh, not um, it, it's so strong but um, they are not having a lot of available points why but um, yeah so the main reason is uh, the Available points are not calculated using the team power. Actually, conversely, it is uh, using the total HP. So total health you have basically. So for five heroes, for example, you know our strongest uh, team in the alliance is Outlaw. So oh, he changed to four nine seven two. But um, you know, try to get a uh, get a uh, better uh, better you know. Um, better defensive, uh, defensive power, so I totally understand that, but uh, look at uh, his points, it's uh, 57 points, available points, for, for myself, um, so myself is 4790, like 180 points, and team power less, but my points, available points is 57 points as well, so basically, you know, uh, for Outlaw, and definitely he does have, um, you know, uh, more strong heroes and, uh, you know, more power, attacking power, defensive power, so which is uh, ideal. So if you do have the privilege and to, to have a lot of points, but, um, you know, a lot of heroes and to try to optimize that and to using the hero with less health, but to more attacking power, more defense, and to that would be ideal. But uh, on the other hand, so if you change your available points, it doesn't mean that your points would be would be you know they will have one less available points. So available points is always one thousand five hundred points. So basically, your points would be just allocated to the other team accordingly. So, for example, you know. Um, I'll just uh, use uh, Mr. Gu as in, an example. So 59 points at the moment. So if I change to a team that is um, the weakest team, for example, you know, a, a lot of saying, people saying, oh, you know, my team is very weak. And uh, I just uh, change to the weakest team and uh, they can get uh, less, you know, available points. For example, I just uh, put uh, a team like this. Oh, that's 999. Okay, great. All right. The available points is only 18 points. 18 points. 
correct. But um, you know, when when you look at Mr. Google, so that's uh, fifty nine points in, increase to sixty. So basically, your available points uh, originally would be allocated to the other teams accordingly. So they will they will have uh, one more points here, one more points there. So that is uh, the um, you know a, a very very interesting thing. And uh, let me just uh, change it back. Okay, so um, and so there is another thing, and uh, that um, I just want to tell you. So the reason I I know that it is um, based on the HP, not the team power. It is um, you know when you look at my team, and uh, total available points is fifty seven points. Um, so if I change to a much stronger Liana, and um, that's uh, team power, so increase. From eight seventy two to eight ninety five. Okay, but the total available points. Okay, fifty seven points as well. All right. So, <clears throat> but um, so if you you know do have um, just a bit with me for a sec. I'll, I'll try to show you. So maybe I I put this one. Okay, now it's fifty seven points, and uh, if I change to Liana, so the team power actually increase, but available points is fifty six points. So basically, you know the um, the points is uh, going down, and uh, just because the HP available HP is uh, is less. So fourteen forty four for Diana, but uh, for for Terraria and um, for Terraria that's fifteen thirty nine. So basically, you know the uh, there is one hundred dot one hundred uh, HP one hundred health difference. So which um, yeah will will create that uh, one point difference. Okay, so um, that's. Um, Pretty much it, and um, but the uh, the main thing is, uh, please, you know, if you have a uh, very um, not a, a strong team like Kiwa, for example, you know, um, so, so sorry to to point you out, but uh, if you have any team like this, and um, yeah, so so don't please don't think oh you have a weak team and uh, you will just uh, change to the uh, lowest available points because uh, your points in basically will be attributed to the other team members and uh, for the other uh, for the other you know uh, opponents they will just uh, basically you know if they don't have a very strong bench they could uh, just uh, use a uh, you know a very crappy you know three star heroes and so basically you know to animate your team and they have additional team to attack the good ones the strong ones and um, you know they will get um, get even more points so basically you know um, and because the alliance wars is basically allocated according to the average average so the average of the every single team so so no one actually has a distinct advantage so if you you know use the low the weakest teams and uh, basically, they put all the pressure to the strongest team's defense. And normally, you know, they will they, they will just uh, kill them in two two shots or three shots. And um, basically, you just uh, give them another shot to to try. You know, the strongest teams. So we'll give them a, a very very you know strong and very big pressure, of course. Um, yeah, I thank you very much for watching this video and uh, if you have any comments or any suggestions and please um, uh, leave and uh, uh, leave a comment uh, comment below. So if you have uh, can could like and subscribe and uh, I will very appreciate that and uh, thank you very much. Have a very good night. See ya.